Man. <laughs> Can I just say how happy I am that this weapon is like the second weapon you get in this game. And it is actually the best weapon competitively. The default splatter shot is actually one of the best weapons right now. Man, that just makes me happy. Well, good morning, good night, or good afternoon, viewers, depending on your time zone. And this is PhilBuds YouTube. Welcome, everybody, to Splatoon 2 Viewer Battles, a.k.a. The Fail Fleet Battles. Hello there, everybody. What's going on? How's it going? Hold on. Will my chat automate swinging correctly? There it is. What's going on, everybody? We're going to be playing a little bit of Splatoon 2. And by we, I mean mostly you guys. I'm going to be commentating it from a perspective of my own conveying to you the words of which i i perceive the game as dude i really wish i could do league battle and ranked battle with my little noob noob squid <laughs> sitting there look at she's so adorable man i love the squids in this game they're so cute ah i'm back boys i'm back finally back from boston it's been, it was a really fun time i had a blast i had an actual blast um nothing exploded luckily but um, the blast was indeed actual. I'll tell you guys all about it. But I'll tell you guys about it once we actually, uh, you know, load up a Splatoon. By the way, how am I sounding? Mom! Splamoom! I see the mooms in chat. Let the mooms happen, mods. Let the mooms happen. It's been a while since I've since I've witnessed the mooms. And it's nice to see them. We're going to be playing a little bit of Splatoon, everybody. We're going to be playing a little bit of Splatoon. So, if you guys are unfamiliar with how this works. I'm not going to put slow chat on. Keep it going. Keep the flow going. Moom! Get those mooms in chat. I want to see them. So what's going to happen right here, if, if you guys aren't familiar with it? Pretty much, um, I spectate, I commentate um, matches between two teams of you guys. So I'm going to go into a private battle. I'm going to create a lobby. A bunch of you guys are going to join in, and we're going to go back and forth. And we're going to do uh, probably three games each. We're going to say three games for now. Maybe two would be best. Uh, guys, what do you say? Two or three games per per set of people. And then we rotate out people and we keep it going from there. That being said, uh, let us go into here and see if we have any new friend requests. I don't have... Actually, you know what? Let me put my friend uh, code in the in the description. Um, so that way you guys can actually add this account. Oh, no. I actually didn't do the description at all. Uh, I am back from Boston. Woo. Live setup, boys. Uh, here is my friend code real fast in case you want to add that and you guys want to play Splatoon with me Otherwise, if you guys don't want to play or you just don't get into the lobby, no actual worries Feel free to enjoy the delicious velvet of my voice uh, as I commentate your matches It's gonna be a fun time. It's gonna be a very fun time. There we go So my description uh, my description should now be in the code exactly That's Exactly what I'm getting at my code should now be in the description if it's not my apologies But don't worry. You'll be up there soon. All right. No more moves. Let them let the mum chill let the mom chill. No worries. We will get our moves in time when I continue my let's play of Super Mario Odyssey. It's sitting right there. It's sitting right there tantalizingly. But don't worry. Those moves will return in due fashion. No more moves for now. Mods. <laughs> Kill them. Kill them. <laughs> Slay the entire chat. Ban the entire chat. All right, boys. So we're. Uh, I think I'm going to be doing two. I think I'm going to be doing two games per per set of people um just because i want to make sure as we can get as many people in as possible and if we can't get as many people in as possible you know i i i'd like to avoid that frankly um and apparently so if you guys ever had this issue of like the camera slightly will just shift to the left when you're doing nothing like right now i'm holding the controllers completely neutral and shifting to the left it's very frustrating and apparently you can fix that by leaving your controller or joy con or you know whatever you're using to control the game down for a second then it'll like auto calibrate my boy ed's taught me that my boy ed's taught me that all right do i need to put the fail fleet symbol no the fail fleet symbol are the two little uh things they know you don't need to use the fail fleet symbol it, you you can you can just do um you can just do uh, whatever tag you have. I'll just add people as, as it is. Well, rather, I've already added a bunch of people. It's you. It's up to you guys to actually join in. So, let's see who our lucky six people are. We're going to go to a creative room. And we're going to go to... Yeah, okay, let's see who we can get in here. Let's see who actually manages to get into this room. As I'm sure it's going to be a it's gonna be a little bit of a pile drive just to, just to enter this room. But don't worry, if you don't get in, don't worry. There'll be plenty of other chances today and in future events. Um, the one thing I do ask is that whoever joins this game... Uh, whether that be Richard or whoever the other people are whoever joins this game I just ask that they don't join future games for this stream if you can, if you know 
if you want to join games in other streams, you're more than welcome to. But in this stream, I'd really prefer if Richard, Isaac, Anika, Trashman, Kitty, Loelzel, Blaine, and Meow number five didn't join in other games for this stream. Also, we're missing one person. You guys can't see it behind the chat, but we are missing one more person. So, uh, I want to see if we can get that person in. They will be on Spectator for the first round, so I suppose it doesn't really matter if they're, if they're in here. Oof! I like this, man. I like this. All right. Man. Let's go. Let's go. So, what are we going to be doing today? What are we going to be doing today? So, first of all, let's start off with... Tower control? Random. You know what? Open it up with tower control random. So, the way it's going to work, if you're those who aren't familiar, I'm going to go spectating. This last person who joined is going to go spectating. I'll rotate that eventually to meow, but for now, it's just going to be oof. Um... And uh, then we're just going to go through it from there, and I'll be going to be commentating. It's going to be a fun time. Um, if you guys did not join in this game, no worries. We will, you'll have chances to join in future games. What's going on with my mic? Why is my mic so, like, loud? My, like, my mic is so loud right now. I need to figure out why it's doing that. It's really strange. I don't get it. All right. So. So. What, what, what is going on with my mic there? I don't understand. Anyway. What the heck? I don't know. What what is what the heck? Taylor, you're freaking me out, man. Mike is Mike is hurting and staticky. What? What's going on here? Hello, hello, hello. The mic went crazy. What is going on, man? Hold on. Hold on. Let me try and fix something real fast here. My apologies. What's going on here? You're about to lose me in a second here. Hello, hello, hello. There we go. Now the mic is looking like much more reasonable levels. I don't know what was going on there. Now the mic is looking like much more reasonable levels. Blah, 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 blah. Hold on. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, blah, 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 blah. There we go. That seems way better. Blah, 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 blah. Sorry about that, guys. I was actually having that issue earlier when I was recording with Shep. But, um... Your mic is horrible? What's going on? Yo, Chad is, is like... There was a bit of static. Well, hopefully this will do it. Hopefully this will do it. I've turned it up to what looks like the correct levels. I'm I apologize if you're watching this in the future. But, um, hopefully this is good from now on. Oh, is it this thing? Hold on. Get ready for a pop. Ah, uh, did my, did, 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 did it make a weird noise just then? Did it make another weird noise? My apologies, but I believe it, it for some reason my audio pops whenever I, whenever I activate the, the chat. Which would be very annoying. But if it... Oh, it did. It did. I still have to fix that. That's so stupid. That's all right. For now, let's commentate this match. And, uh, you know, let's just get on with it. We're going to do uh, Tower Control on Manti Maria. So, the other thing we're going to be doing with this... up, uh, prepare for a pop. There we go. I'll try not to talk during that segment. But, um... What we're going to be doing is in chat... Now, this is, again, on the honor system. You don't get it. You don't win anything from this... Um, you know, this is just like a little bit of a bonus thing that you guys can do. I want you guys to count how many games you win. So, we're gonna, in, the, in these matches, right, in these matches, um, we're gonna have teams like blue versus orange, you know, green versus purple, turtle versus hair. I want you guys to say, at the beginning of the match, what color you think is going to win, and then, whoa, someone just left. Nope. Cancel. What happened? No, cancel! I pressed B to cancel! What is this? What is this? How do I exit this? I refuse. This does not count towards towards the thing. This does not count towards the thing. What is three versus three? Hold up, what? Never mind, it counts towards the thing. Apparently we had two disconnects. What brilliant convenience that we happen to have two disconnects. I mean, I guess whatever works, but uh, Count in chat, um, or say in chat what team you think is gonna win this 3v3. That's a little bit unexpected. 
But um, I guess what you know, whatever ends up working is whatever ends up working. Welcome everybody to our 3v3 right here. So um, yeah, say in chat what team you think is gonna win. We got green versus blue. Call it now. Um, and at the end of every match, say once uh, what number you. Oh gosh, what number of games you've gotten correct. Um, and at the end, we're gonna see who has the highest. It doesn't. It doesn't really matter in, in the long end of the scheme. It's just for your own ability to try and predict the flow of the match based just upon your favorite color. You know, the best way to judge the winner of a match. But going into it right now, we got a three versus three, blue versus green, tower control on Manta Maria. This map has a lot of walls, so if we see anything with Stingray, you know, it's gonna like absolutely tear through things. Like right now, Trash Man. Oh, that's right. I remember Trash Man from a previous stream, man. Trash Man with his big old trash can, gonna be throwing, bu gonna be throwing ink and shooting lasers. Gonna be actually very effective on this map as it's gonna be like super useful for just covering the point. But right now he is gonna get flanked around to the side here as uh, Mr. Lauzel, Lauzel, I believe it is. It's gonna be trying to come in from the side with that Splatter Shot Pro. Splatter Shot Pro, one of the um, better weapons in Splatoon 2 right now after a, after a recent buff. Gonna be very effective. However, he does get taken out by the trash man with the trash can. Coming in from the back here, throwing that ink, man. It's super useful. He's also become a waypoint for the rest of his team to jump in here. However, we have Meow number five, a pre another return. Coming in from the top with those sniping plays. Gonna be taking out one person and going to be trying to take it out another. However, our teammate comes with the assist, taking out the trash man with the trash can. Good push from green, stopping, or rather, good defense from green, stopping blue's push. And right now, we have Blaine coming in from the side. Gonna be getting a, oh, was that a double splat? Potentially, but right now, he is taking back the tower for their team. And right now, blue definitely in the lead. Green with one person down. Or actually, with no people down, that's right, it's a 3v3. Um, gonna be having an interesting time. Blaine getting one flank on an enemy. However, getting outflanked himself as Meow number five comes in from the top with that sniper shot. We're gonna be seeing a Stingray coming up from Trashman. Gonna be trying to pick up a pick up a kill, and he will get Lauzel. Very strong play from Trashman, keeping people away. And right now, just trying to get back on the point. Gonna be trying to get as many more points as they can. And right now, wow, yeah, <laughs> Richard coming in with the bucket, but unable to do anything right now. Lauzel gonna be hanging around up top. Trying to make some claim here with the Splattershot Pro. Gonna be getting one kill. Gonna be trying to get another kill. But he's not gonna get it as they get baller. Do you want to play ball, son? By the boy, Blaine. Isaac in the air right now. Gonna be trying to do a little bit of painting, do a little bit of work. Going to be trying to secure their lead. And it actually looks like we have Blaine using that crack on splat, uh, that crack on, excuse me, the crack on, uh, roller. To try and reclaim it. Look at that little Alfred go! <laughs> I'm sorry, but do you see Alfred de trying desperately to get that double pick? It was so adorable. I loved it, man. I love Alfred. Alfred is the most adorable thing ever. I really hope we get that that weapon that adds in um, the the auto bomb army soon. Oh, that's gonna be a that's gonna be a good time. That's gonna be a good time. But right now, Blue with a very solid lead right now. This is, uh, pretty uncontested. Pretty uncontested. Green has been trying to get back into on the point here, but really has been unable to contest what Blue has going for them. And it looks like we have Blaine doing uh doing a little bit of a uh, spin work on them, and actually gonna get a lot of kills right here, and going to be able to move the point a little bit more forward. Gonna go into baller mode there too, and not gonna be able to get a pick. Green smart, not jumping down recklessly, but meow number five. He's just gonna be sitting up here trying to get a pick on Blaine. Does get the pick on Blaine. This could be exactly what they need to start getting themselves back into the game. Gonna be trying to get that pick on Isaac. However, it looks like we have Trash Man hanging up at the ceiling. Gonna be trying to net any kills that they can. Gonna get into Meow number five. Gonna be putting some pressure on the point. Ooh, Isaac gonna be going down to Richard. Richard with the bucket. It's a bucket battle, but the Trash Man with the trash can saying, I trash can do whatever I want. Gonna be getting that kill. Sorry, I popped off on top of there for a second there. However, Lauzel is going to be killing them. Isaac just trying to desperately paint the point is going to be desperately painting the point with the enemy's color. This is Green's last attempt, their last push. Can they do it, man? Can the trash man with the trash can be taken out them as only he can? The bubbler is going to be a very strong play right now, although one bubble went completely away. Oh no, trash man with the trash can going to be sending out that stingray. Making it very hard for Green to contest, and that is going to be the game. Blue has won. People say in chat if you if you wanted Blue to win. 
say one or zero, one being you have won, or zero being you have not won. Again, nothing matters at the end of the day. Nothing matters at all. Yeah, Trash Man with that S plus, and Kitty also! Oh no, that's right, Kitty was not in the actual game. That's disappointing, man, that's disappointing. But, let's get some new people. Oh, we got Warlord in here, and we got Nika in here. I believe these are our two new people. Uh, so let's go, excuse me? What are these disconnects? We need one more person, it looks like. But we're gonna be doing um, Splat Zones Random. Let's see, let's see. Not enough moves, 7.9 out of 10, understandable, frankly. Up, uh, Nick Paul 19, there we go, Nick, there, Nick Paul 19. Going into it, Splat Zones, random map. Nick Paul, you are gonna be on the spectator because you are the last person to join. Let's go into Black Belly Skate Park. A brand new map uh, to Splatoon 2, not a new map to Splatoon 1. Gonna be interesting, man. This, this map is, is very vertical, as am I. Um, has a very interesting choke point on the right, and it has, it has a lot of things in this meta. Uh, you know, Stingray is gonna be very useful against it. Lenny. Lenny, please. Lenny, ready? Ready? Ah, Lenny is ready! Let's go, boys. All right, chat. Which team are you on? We're gonna see in a second what teams we got available to us. Looks like we got available to us green and... Hello, the wacky arm guy. Green and purple, chat. Green and purple. Pledge your allegiance in chat. Green or purple. Say it now. Declare it now. Or forever hold your breath. All right. Going into this game. Trash man with the trash can is on green. We got... Uh, who's on purple? Who's on purple? We got Isaac. We got Warlord. Warlord can be a monster, man. I've seen them do some very, very good work. And they are rocking those dapple dualies, man. They're gonna make those look good, probably. Because the dapple dualies are very good at shredding. However, the trash man with the trash can is gonna be taking him out. Charging up that special a little bit and claiming these points. And right now, it looks like Isaac coming in from the top here, just trying to put as much pressure as he can on the point. But Lenny, with the great control of the skies here, Lenny rocking that default splatter shot. Oh, the hero splatter shot, excuse me. Gonna be getting almost a double kill with the assist from Trash, uh, trash Man with the trash can. Good stuff from Lenny, good stuff from Lenny. Took a while to ready up and showing that it was worth it in the end. And right now, we, it, dude, this map is heavily in green side. And that's a very strong thing. Map control is always very important. But right now, Warlord coming in from the side with a suction bomb rush. Gonna be trying to get some kills and paint the zone. Gonna get one kill. Gonna try and net another. He has a chance. Two down. Three down. Very strong opportunity right now for Purple to try and claim the point. And they do so in spades. Warlord, the, 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 the spearhead of that push, doing a very good job. So right now it's on green to try and make the push back into the point. Lenny just taking a moment to sit around to the side. Gonna be trying to opt for the flank up there. Let's see what, what Lenny can do. They're hanging out. They're waiting. They're taking a second. They are jumping right into the point. Interesting. That must have either been on a beacon or, or to, by another member. And it looks like green is gonna be able to try and yeah, definitely clean these points. Very interesting. What's happening right now? Are we down a member? We are down a member! Another disconnect! Oh no, and it was a crack on roller too! That's very unfortunate as their beacons would have been very useful. And right now we can just see how much map control, how much map control this green has right now. Lenny trying to outflank Warlord, and it looks like they are going to indeed do so. This is looking very just unfortunate for purple. Wow. This this is this is very unfortunate right now. Isaac trying his best to make it in there, but uh, we'll die. Isaac dies to many things in uh in the body of Isaac, and it looks like uh that that is gonna remain true here. And I I feel pretty bad for for purple team right now. Trash man with a trash can throwing his trash laser in the air like he don't care, and it is going to be green taking this game. And whoa, we had a new sponsor while I was popping off there. Thank you very much, Cooper's World, the Angry Bird 95. Thank you very much, man. I, I, I appreciate that. Anika with the disconnect. Yeeks. But, oh my gosh, thank you so much, Cooper's World. I, I, I really appreciate that. Uh, message me on Twitter what your, um, what your, uh, what your Discord, or not what your Discord, what your Switch uh, code is. And I can add you into, um, I can add you into my main account. But, we got one more game in here. We got one more game in here. Let's do Rainmaker on... Random. <laughs> Jabated. Rainmaker on random. Evil Squid, you are going to be spectating. Oh my gosh, so many disconnects. I haven't even had to move the spectator thing this entire time. 
I really appreciate that, Cooper's World. Thank you very much. I also want to change an emote. I want to get rid of the Hank emote. I love Hank, but he's like, we need a new emote. My name is Anika. A Annie? Annie Ika? Annie Ika? My apologies if, if I'm not pronouncing that correctly. I believe Annie Ika? Annie Ika? My apologies. But, um, yeah, I want to I wanted change out the Hank emote to something else. Well, so chat, I want you guys to recommend what, what, what you guys think I would have for an emote. But, I'm thinking it would be either like a Moom emote or something like that. But, going into this game, or maybe something with Splatoon. I don't know. It's gotta be something. Splat Moom? It's either gotta be Moomy or Anika. Anika? I'll, I'll, I'll say Anika for now. But, going into this game, we got yellow versus blue. Chat, say it in chat. What you got? Yellow or blue? Yellow or blue? So going into- Oh my gosh, yo! I want to take a look at Lenny's perspective. Lenny is rocking full swim speed, at least on his mains. I mean, I'm not sure what they got on the subs, but uh, that's pretty good. And right now, it looks like we do indeed finally have a full 4v4 match. Finally, I didn't even know those existed, frankly. But, we got Nick Paul with the Rainmaker right now. Whoa! Whoa! Warlord coming in from behind! With a nice kill set there. And also the Rainmaker has been taken care of. He was standing still while the Rainmaker was being pushed. I was a little bit scared for a second there. But the Rainmaker was secured by their team. Warlord coming in with that Suction Bomb Rush. Going to be very effective. I think Suction Bomb Rush is one of the best ones. It, it just adds so much pressure. And whoa! Meow number 5 with their superior sniping skills is going to get a double pick. One was very important as it took out... The trash man with the trash can who was contesting Blaine for a second there. Very strong sniping skills coming out from them. Very strong indeed. And right now, Blaine trying to hold the Rainmaker for as long as they can. They're going to be taken out though by Lenny. And just by the rest of the blue team entirely. And right now, this is, um, this is yellow, this is rather blue's chance to try and get a little bit of a push happening. There is one person down on the team of yellow. So this is what they try need to try and do. And right now, Lenny trying to opt to going all the way out there, but does get taken out by Blaine. Sorry, I had to identify who that was for a second there. Uh, Blaine did take them out. So Blaine, now in possession of the Rainmaker. The trophy of those he has defeated. The trophy of those he has slain. Has been told not to retreat. Blaine, if you retreat, then you the you risk the Rainmaker blowing up. Right now, Warlord going in with the enemy. Trashman versus Warlord. Top 10 anime battles. Trashman does manage to take him out. Take him out to the trash man. But, um, it seems... Oh, but we should also take a look at Nick Paul. Although it does look, for just a second there, like Meow has gotten another pick. Yo, Meow is going actually wild with these picks. Is going to be using a suction bomb rush thanks to the power of that fire fin splatter scope. They're going to be doing a lot of good stuff here. going to be doing a lot of good stuff here. Meow of realizing that they are being contested from behind is going to be trying to do what they can. However, Trashman with the trash can is going to be trying to come up from the back. From the front, directly from the front. Gonna be trying to take out Meow, their only real threat here. Going to be activating their Stingray. But Blaine comes in from behind with a little bit of a squid dance. So, you know, that insult to injury. And it looks like the Rainmaker is gonna get pretty close to its destination there. Blue is definitely looking to push it a little bit more. But whoa! Great job hiding from Luauzel. Just hanging out for a second there. Going to be able to stop the Rainmaker's push in its direction. Meow number five, gonna be desperately clinging for the wall. As they try and get a pick, is going to miss one, is going to miss two, and is unfortunately going to be able, not able to really do too much here. Lenny taking this opportunity to just run away. It looks like we have Meow number five with the Rainmaker. What will they be able to do, man? They're trying to come in through the top. They have activated the line, the ink line for them to climb. This is their opportunity. Treasure in the trash can stuck down low there. Right now it's up to Lenny. And Nick Paul to kill him, and oh my gosh, Nick Paul does manage to kill him. Nick Paul using the GooTuber too. Man, the GooTuber is the ultimate meme. It's the ultimate meme right now. Oh, for a second, thought they swam underneath it. Thought they just swam underneath it. But whoa, Warlord with the desperate trade there, able to try and take out the Rainmaker in their tracks. And it looks like Meow number five right now. Oh, excuse me. Meow number five trying. Keep the Rainmaker at bay right there. Oh, that Stingray gonna be coming out. The Trash Man with the Trash Can gonna be spraying all over the enemy team. Warlord. 
dang, it's not <laughs> Warlord is a master of wars, man. They've seen a lot of things. Trash Man is a master of trash. They've also seen many things. Less sightly things. I mean, to be fair, which is worse? War or trash? Probably war. But yeah, I don't know. I've seen some horrible things in the trash. I think I've seen Purple Chef in there a couple times. I think I've seen like, Amelia in there sometimes, you know. There's, there's a lot of stuff in the trash. But, meanwhile, Blue trying to secure a little bit of a lead here. Because right now, they are 40 points behind with 30 seconds remaining. This is, uh, this is not looking too good. However, it's Rainmaker. This could change with two sweeps. Maybe even one sweep. Warlord, though! Master of, of Disguise, Master of the Onslaught, jumps in from the top, getting those kills. A very important one, if I do say so myself. And now we're going to be trying to just move that Rainmaker as far back as he can. The Wows are going to be taking him out, though. And Trashman with the Trash Can, hitting as many as he can with that Stingray. Right now, it's down to the Wowzel and Lenny and Nick Paul and the rest of Blue Team to try and secure this kill. It's going to be very tough. They are surrounded and they are going to be taken out. That is going to be Yellow's victory. Woo! It's three Wumi State. There you go, man. Wow. Very solid game. Very solid game from these players. Man, we had A+, plus, A-, minus, S+, plus, and a bunch of Cs. A lot of kills, though. Wow, a lot of kills coming in from this game. Man, oh, man. Good games. Good games, everybody. Good games. So, that being said, we are going to get a new round of people. So, I just asked that anyone who joined any of any of these games, um, anyone who joined um, these games today, uh, just don't 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 join in for the rest of the stream. You're free to join in, in other streams, but just for today, don't join in any of these any more of these games. All right, let's get some new people in here. Let's get some new people in here. Create a room. No password. Get in here, people. Get in here. Let's see who we can get. Let's see who we can get. Rip the trash man with a trash can. Let's do the Odyssey. It's time to jump up in the air. Jump up without a care. Man, I do. I love that song. Sorry to just break out the singing, but man, that song is actually fire. I've been listening to that song way too much recently. Like, all the time. Let's go, man. We got a new, a completely new cast of people, if I'm not mistaken here. We got Viper Salt, Dope Gaming, Toon Noah, hello. Inferno, Draw Risu, hey, I remember you. Adam, CreeperCon, Stevie, and Kuro. All right, boys. Let's get into it. We're going to start off with Rainmaker this time. Uh, we're going to run it to my favorite place ever. My favorite place ever. My face. My favorite combo. My face. Humpback Pump Track Rainmaker. The Maker Breaker. I'm going to be on Spectator. Kuro is going to be on Spectator. And let's go right into it. 10 10 jump up Superstar cover. Which is better. Supersonic. Sorry. Odyssey theme or Sonic Forces. Is Sonic. Does Sonic Forces even have a theme? <laughs> Other than just like. Disappointment.mp3. Sit down. Hedgehog star. <laughs> I did it, guys. I made a bad joke. Clap emotes. Ah, what is this? Oh, no. Sorry, I have an alarm that just went off. Hold on, I have to actually... I have to actually uh, fit, uh, message back something with this alarm. But we do have green versus blue right now. I will commentate in this in a second. Give me one sec. I, I, you know, we're just going to let it uh, hang up here for just one second. Give me one second. We can just, oh my gosh, I will commentate on that amazing, almost near blue wipe for a second here. And honestly, this game might be over before I can even do anything about it. Green taking it away. I can't actually see the, or, you know, use the controller right now. You guys can't even see this push. It's all happening behind the chat. Rainmaker person, get out from behind the chat. It's not okay. It's not okay. You can't do that. And don't gaming try to get in there. Sorry, man. Okay, uh, uh, Game. My phone actually just died right now. I have to replug it back in. No, don't use the Rainmaker. Don't use the Cloud. I actually can't commentate games I can't see. All right, I, I have control over my, my controllers again for a second. Here. Two Noah going in. What's the situation right now? It looks like we have two down and a three down right here. Whoa! It looks like Green almost actually won the game for a second there. No offense, blueberries are perfect. Right. Understandable, understandable. Oh, don't retreat! Adam! Do not retreat. Bear man. Get in there. Oh, no, Alfred. Dude, I love the little... Oh, Dog Gaming in the wing. 
did not get the kill they were looking for. But then they got the kill they were looking for. Dude, Doe Game was just hanging out there. So cheeky-like. So cheeky-like. And they are going to be taking care of the Rainmaker. They are going to be getting that pick on two Noah. Let's see what they can do, man. They're going to be coming in from the side. Blue tried their best to catch up the green in points. But it looks like we have Adam coming around the side here with those splatter bombs. Or, or burst bombs, rather. Is not going to get the pick as they get picked instead. Inferno. Bringing in the actual Inferno of Ink. Using those splat dualies. But right now, it looks like Go Gaming trying to make claim to the point once again. Going to be going up and going to be going down as they secure this game. This game is going to be going to green with that easy KO. Good games to the players. Please, chat, say what number you're on. How many wins did you get correct? If, if you got none correct, then you know you got none correct. Understandable. If you got all of them correct, understandable. Again, there's no prize for this. All right. Let's go into the next game, though. So we're going to be doing, uh, not Turf Wars. No, 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 no. Splat Zones. On. Let's do it. Inkblot Art Academy. One big old point in the middle. Um, sure, you're going to be on Spectator. One big old point in the middle with a big old, uh, like, pillar in the middle as well. Very important to control. You can also jump at that pillar from the spawn point, so it's going to be pretty useful. Ooh, what's, also, what's up, Ian? Oh, I saw you in chat, though. What's up, man? Four? Wait, there were four? Maybe. Potentially. So let's get everyone to ready up. We got Kuro needs to ready up, and we got Doe Game needs to ready up. But everyone needs to choose their uh, to choose their weapons and clothing and stuff. So you know, I'm not gonna rush it too much. I'm gonna be a dually. Understandable. Is Splatoon your favorite Switch game? Oh, like actually 100%. <laughs> so much fun, man! So much fun. All right, boys. Gonna be getting into it. streaming at 1080p, 60 FPS. Subscribe. Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much. All right. Splats, sorry, I just clapped. I, there's really no reason. Dude, I like Evil Squid. Dude, I kind of want to watch Evil Squid for a second. They got they got a nice little loadout going on here. Uh, whoa, we also have a bunch. Dude, Doe Gaming CreeperCon rocking some interesting builds here, too. Yo, Evil Squid, though, actually kind of looking like an Evil Squid. We got the, uh, the evil, evil looking kind of clothing, clothing on, as well as the gal. Like, absolutely one of the strongest weapons in the game here. And I'm not sure what they're doing with their camera. Right now, it looks like purple has definitely claimed... Purple or pink, what, magenta, whatever this is, has definitely claimed uh, this point for now. And it's, it's, it's going to be a matter of if green can get back in here or not. Right now, draw Risu. I believe they were using the brush before. Going for the 100% strategies, painting everything that is green. And they're going to have a hard time painting everything now that everything is green. Doe Gaming coming in here with one of my favorite weapons aesthetically. The Golden Carbon Roller. Going to be, or uh, the Golden Dynamo Roller, excuse me. Going to be absolutely devastating if you get hit by it. But right now, it looks like the Carbon Roller, rather the, um, the Hero Roller, is going to be doing all the work for themselves. And honestly, looks like this is about to be a complete clean sweep for purple here two fast matches in a row it looks like indeed it is two fast matches in a row i would die for golden carbon it would actually be really fun i would admit but wow just like that that is going to be the get this is going to be the game man oh man come back and kill myself for such magnificence exactly man wow well there we have it Rip indeed, rip indeed. Sad quake, boys. All right. Well, we got one more game in us. <laughs> I like this guy's name. You actually can't see him. I don't want to make the microphone pop, but you'll see him in game. We have Philbo in one fourth. <laughs> one fourth of a Philbo in the chat now. Gonna have to see how that works. But uh, we got, we're gonna go tower control. Sturgeon ship, Sturgeon shipyard. There we go. Uh, we are going to make evil squid into there and we're gonna make Kuro spectating. All right, boys. Going into it. Wait, no! No, I didn't mean to make Kuro spectating. Ah, my bad, my bad. Either way, <coughs> one fourth of a failboat. Yeah, you can actually probably see them now. We got Doe Gaming Inferno, Creeper Con, one fourth of a failboat, two Noah, Drawrisu, Adam, and Evil Squid in this game. Let's go, boys. Be sure to vote in chat what uh what you guys are uh, a fan, what, what team you guys are joining. However, don't forget, you know, these, these two colors are not actually going to be the in-game colors, which is a little stupid, but you know, whatever ends up working. Whatever ends up working. What do you mean, Philbo? Very other... I, I, I just sort of mean everything. So, how was Boston? Thank you very much for asking, Cooper's World. So, Boston was actually very fun. I roomed with Etz, met a lot of people, met Dude, if you know him. 
Um, and a lot of really awesome Splatoon players, Yoko, uh, Shiny Hunter Zack, uh, Nine Whole Grains, just like a bunch of Splatoon people that I hope to actually work with in the future. But um, going into it, we got this delightful little game, and I kind of want to get, oh, Adam, squid of my heart, using the drop roller. Man, I, I love the drop roller, right? uh, the drop roller here. As you can see on their feet, they got the drop roller. And as you can begin to pick on Creeper Con right now, that end zap is going to be doing a lot of work since that buff. Going to be getting another pick on the point. Very strong play from Adam, only to be contested by our Doe Gaming Sniper back there. Going to be rocking that, I believe it's the E-Leader, the custom E-Leader. Uh, rocking those bubbles, and whoa! Going to be getting a pick right there. <laughs> wow, we actually got a lot of snipers going on here. Whoa! Phil Hoda, one fourth! Unaware that Evil Squid was coming in from the side there with that 52 gal. I do like the, the juxtaposition of, of one of the snipers being like, get down, and the other sniper's like, what do you mean I see no threat? Evil Squid, though, doing a good job coming in from the side there. Going to be trying to claim the point in the name of Orange, and it looks like they're doing a pretty good job right now. Green trying as best they can to contest the point. It looks like Inferno showing the Inferno of their wrath going to be getting that kill. Should be letting some friends jump down too. Feel one for I actually never knew you could see the name of who's jumping down on the little circle there. That's pretty interesting. It's actually pretty interesting. Two and Noah going to be taken out with that brush, and right now it's just a job of Inferno and Spillbone and one four to hold this point for as long as they can to try and reclaim that lead. That suction bomb going to be doing some work. However, Inferno using that inkjet going to be contested by those bubbles. Actually, those bubbles are on their side. Going to be doing very good for Green, and right now. Orange, what can you do? Evil Squid coming from the top there with that 52 gal. Will they be able to do any work with it, man? That point sense are going to be uh, figuring out who's on that point. And they are going to be able to stop Green's push before they are going to be able to take the lead. With Evil Squid with his glowing eyes right there, man. It's kind of menacing if I do say so myself. And right now, Green trying their best to contest, but unable to contest with the best. As Toon No and everyone else goes in. However, Doe Gaming from the top with that custom E Leader 4K going to be coming up. However, I do believe they're about to be flanked by Draw Risu with that brush. However, Draw Risu is flanked by another member of the team. Incredible play by everyone. And everyone's jumping down for the point right now. Inferno on the point right now, just trying to bring it away to prevent Orange from getting any further of a lead. Do know with that brush going to be getting a kill on Creeper Con right there. Draw Reese. Dude, this is brushes versus chargers. I'm liking it, man. I'm liking it a lot. Do know with that inkjet going to be trying to put a little bit of pressure on the other team here. The snipers might be able to pick him down, but are unable to. And with that long distance shot, is going to be sniping out Creeper Con. To Noah making a making the enemies look like a cartoon in and of themselves, man. Making them look like they're actually just slapstick comedy as they try to fight against him. Amazing stuff from Toonno. Amazing stuff from Toonno. Somehow manages to get on that point and take control of the tower. And to try and further the lead, but no! The sniper play gonna be coming in here. Only Evil Squid left alive. Gonna be taking out one. Potentially gonna be taking out two, maybe? Or maybe he will be taking out two, but no, they are gonna be taking out two. Very strong play, man. And that echo locator, that point sensor, is going to be very important for a gal player. A gal relying on the strength of their own gun entirely is going to be taking a lot of use of that point sensor. Right now, Inferno coming in, but also going to be taken out by Evil Squid. Evil Squid showing how menacing they can truly be here. Just keeps on taking out everyone on the enemy team. My gosh. Painting the ground with the color of orange. Evil Squid just not letting Green have anything. And right now, gonna be taking out CreeperCon. Gonna be going in there and maybe taking out Doe Gaming. However, Doe Gaming did make a very strong getaway and is going to be trying to take a pick at Noah, who's just moving a little bit too much to be captured. Gonna be taking out Failbo one fourth. Good stuff from every player involved right here. Just frankly, just amazing play. However, they do not have the point anymore. The point is absolutely gone. But they have indeed reclaimed it. Inferno going to be taken out by the enemy team. And right now, Green just can't seem to find the opportunity they're looking for to get back into it. Draw Risu and Tuno are just doing too good of a job of getting close to the snipers and taking them out before they can be really a threat. Who will win this, man? Chat, say your allegiance once more. Can't change it, but say it again. Is it orange? Is it green? 
stick with your team and see what we got going on. Right now, still more than one fourth. Dude, they did such a desperate play to try and take control of that point. That was very admirable of them. But right now, it's looking very desperate for Green. They are not in a great situation with only the Elite Leader 4K in the lead. And they have lost the game, being unable to get on that point before it could count. Good stuff from Green. Good stuff from Orange. But Orange's ability to just hold that game throughout the entirety of it was the cause of their win. So if you've seen Thor Ragnarok, I saw him as hilarious. Besides the curse ones. I have not seen Thor Ragnarok. I have not seen it. But wow, man. Amazing job. Amazing job from both people. I'm a, I'm a church right now. I got there early. I am a church right now. I got there. I am a church. All right, boys. So that is going to be the end of this group. Um, let's get in a new round of people. And this may, may be the last. Oh, whoops. Hello. That is me. Uh, this may be the last group, but we'll see, but we'll see. Let's, let's, let's add some friends. Let's add some friends. Why? <laughs> Why does every time I do this, we just get another, like, 50 more people? Goodness. Every time I do this, it's just it's so many more people, man. It's got an Amash. Bamboozle them. That was my joke, by the way. How nice. It's got to give them the bamboozle. All right, well, we are going to add every single person here just for sake of time. Uh, but I will add you guys in the in the off camera so that way the next time I do this you have the potential to join in uh, We're gonna add like uh, Five to ten more people Let's see who we got here. We got whoa, We got a giant look at the eyes on that Lenny face man. Look at the eyes on him. It's creepy. It's very creepy Who we got now we got Charlotte. I like your me small smile small face and it's actually a very default face I like it. I like what you have. We got the uh, inkling picture. I'm a big fan of it. I'm a big fan of it. Oh god I bring up church once the chat is lost. Oh, we are adding a Japanese player potentially Maybe that was just a Japanese name or something. I don't know. I will build a church to sell the merch like Philboats shirts Oh, that was actually kind of almost a rap a words that rhyme cohesively almost almost Please wait for me. I'm sorry. I, I really don't have a, the ability to, to dictate who actually gets into the games all I can do is uh, wish you guys the best of luck and say that the people who previously joined cannot join again. <laughs> I like the ghost, man. Dude, that ghost me is so cool. I saw it as a face at first, and I'm like, wait a minute, what? Then I saw it, and I was like, oh, I get it. Hey, running me with the $1 dollar. Thank you very much, running me. Dan, have you worked on your lines for the diss track? Yes, I have been. I have been working on those lines, man. I got it. I got it lined up. I got it set. Not entirely. But I got those lines coming in here. <laughs> Man, I love I love the Herald face. Yo, if we got any um, if we got any uh, feel uh, the the what lifeboats? If we got any lifeboats in the chat, the fail subs. Let me see some Herald faces. Let me see some Herald faces in the chat. Herald faces are so cool, man. I love them. He looks like he's gasping. It's adorable. I love it. All right. Let's get three more. Three more. Here we go. We got one or three. <laughs> Give it two more. Three. Two. Smash man number one here. Two. One. All right. That was the last one. We're backing out. We backing out. We add in more people later on. But for now, we're going to get right back into the games. I'm Twitch sub if that counts. There you, I, I appreciate the lifeboats uh, on Twitch. I appreciate the lifeboats on Twitch. I apologize you guys can't have emotes. I wish you guys could. But in the Twitch one, you can. Nintendo board meeting. I have an idea. Why not add an all friends button? No! Too busy working on our uh, Alfred machine here. Dude, I, I, like, why, why can't we just add all friends? Everyone, yeah, everyone laughs in unison. All right, guys. Well, my name's Smashman number one. Welcome back to my Roblox Let's Play. Exactly, man. Exactly. Let's go, boys. Private battle. Create a room. What's the password going to be? We're mixing it up. There's actually a password. But what is the password? What is the password? The password's going to be... 4578. Bam. 4578. Can people make it in? Who is the fastest typer? 
other than the people, you know, that can't join anymore. Also, we're gonna start on rain, uh, splat zones, uh, splat zones, more eight towers. That's stressful enough. Four, five, seven, eight. Can people make it in? Four, five, seven, eight. Who do we appreciate? Seth Zilla made it in. Whoa! We got a good amount of people making it in. We got everyone new making it in. Very nice, very nice. Seth Zilla, Cuddle Fresh, uh, Kitty, Space Lou, Kai, Thor Steyer, uh, Nug Boy. <laughs> Nug Boy. Uh, <coughs> Anne's already in, you know. Anne's already in, you know. Uh, and I'm liking it, man. Everyone better spam Booyah, whoever's team he's on. All right, guys. Blood Zones, more eight towers. Let's go, boys. I'm going to use 11 quick super jump. Goodness me. All right, boys. <clears throat> I'm going to be spectating. Booyah's going to be spectating. I guess everyone better Booyah and in respect for Booyah. But, um... Let's get into this game, man. Let's get into this game. More eight towers. It is a, uh, it, it's a map. <laughs> it is a map. It's a, uh, it's an interesting one. Kai prays for turf war. Four, five, seven, eight. I wish I had a kick. Nine, one. There. <laughs> Boo you. Boo yeah. I was going into it right here. It's gonna be a fun time. It's gonna be a fun time. So, chat. Who we got? We got yellow versus what? Yellow versus what? Or I guess it's more orangey. Orange versus purple, man. Say it in chat, boys. Say it in chat. Who we got? Orange versus purple. Go into this game. A new everything. A new everything. New players. Everything, man. Kai already has my heart. The Splushomatic is such a fun weapon. But right now, Orange immediately trying to take control of the point. But uh, wow, this is a kerfuffle. It's my favorite thing to say, man. But this is an absolute kerfuffle starting off this game. Already, Orange down to everyone but a Dynamo Roller who got a double. That was a Dyna double, man. The Dyna double special coming down, splatting down. And clearing the way for Orange to take control of the first set of points. Actually, it's Purple to take control of the first set of points. But that Dyna double was so good. However, that approach to the top ledge was not that good. As they are going to be taken immediately by Thor style. And the points are going to be immediately taken over by Purple. Whoa! But that Dyna, that Dyna double was, was something else. That's, that's an exclusive special available only at your local diner. Exactly. But uh, Thorstein gonna be sending out those pit levels. Actually gonna be getting that kill. All that they, you know, since they were only targeting one person. But right now, Thorn style probably not liking that they happen to challenge that hornet's nest of orange. But Space Loot gonna be coming in here with that splatter down. That splash down is splash down, right? That splash down is very powerful. Splash down is so good, man. You just punch the earth. Have you ever tried punching your floor and then a giant explosion of color happens? probably red since the explosion is probably of your own blood like <laughs> i can't recommend it in real life but i can't recommend it enough in splatoon it's very effective it's very effective right now nuggable i gotta make almond down here with that hammer down from that roller hammer down from the roller is super effective and right now speaking of being effective purple man purple is doing an excellent job of controlling this game up until captain cuddlefresh came in here and was able to potentially help Orange control the points. Even for just a second, they were able to control, but now for more than a second. But that second was all they needed to just make it so Purple has that penalty timer on it now. So right now, Kitty, ooh, Kitty doing a good job just hunting, laying in wait there with that silver dynamo roller. They have control over the points. But that splashdown from Nugboy is going to be coming in here, covered by the Tenta missiles. They are going to be trying to make a play. They are going to be taken out, though, by Spacey Lou. Rocking that splatter shot. Rocking that splashdown. And rocking that ability to control the points. This is looking very good for them. And right now, very unfortunate for Purple. Being unable to really control the point. Kai just going to run in there and die immediately to the onslaught of Purple. Of uh, Orange. And right now, it looks like Orange actually has the potential to make this entire run back. Can they do it, man? They are in the lead. This is going to be very good for them. And right now, Spacey Lou just going to try to make sure they can, they keep control of the point. Thor style, trying to control as much as they can. Potentially on the brink of doing it. 
They need to get both points. They need it so desperately to stop that orange counter. And they are going to be unable to do it, it looks like. Maybe, just maybe, but no. Orange is going to get that reverse sweep. Very strong plays. Very strong plays indeed. The orange is literally mac and cheese color. You're right. You're entirely right. That's a very, very strong thing there. Oh my gosh. And very good plays, man. Very good plays from both teams. But orange is going to take that despite having like ferociously less kills. Very strong plays. Very strong plays. All right. <clears throat> Saying chat, what, what, uh, what amount of wins you got? Saying chat, what amount of wins you got? But going into it, we're going to do tower control, port mackerel tower control. Oof. It's a good time, man. Oh, also, uh, we're going to make, no, Booyah, I believe Wolverine. I, do we have a disconnect and then someone joined? I guess so, because Wolverine was not in this game before. Wolverine is going to be sitting at this game. We are going to be going to this game with this cast of people. Finally, we got Booyah on a team. Everyone better Booyah for the start of this game. Otherwise, you guys have actually... No honor or respect for the game and the sport. Yoopa! Exactly, man, exactly. Dude, I love the little boop boops. Boop boops. Very entertaining. Poor Mackle, man. Every time I read that name, it just makes me hungry. <laughs> makes me very hungry. I would love to eat fish right now. I love. Oh, also, speaking of fish, yo, Octodad comes out tomorrow on the Switch. Guess who's gonna be playing Octodad on stream? Not me, Jabated. No, I actually will be. It's, it's going to be very fun. I've never played it before, so I, I'm i very eager to play Octodad. I've heard so many amazing things about that game. One of the best indie games I've ever I've, I've ever heard of. But I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to be interested in playing it. But say it now in chat what team you're on. You got team green or team blue. And right now, we got Booyah. Saying Booyah. The entire team rocking Booyah. The honor is real. The respect is real. The, the respect to the craft. Mac and cheese, as we've uh, established before. Booyah with that golden arrow spray is a one-way ticket right to my heart. Because I absolutely love that thing. But unfortunately, it's also a one-way ticket to uh, getting taken out as blue with that full team wipe over green. This is not looking too good for green uh, at, at any time whenever you see a wipe happen. It, it's definitely never the uh, optimal time for a wipe. There's no ever optimal time for a weapon. Right now, Spacey is going to be opting to go all the way back in order to try and get as many Tenta Missiles as possible. But right now, it's just looking very dominant for Blue Nug Boy just waiting on point as Booyah attempts to go up to Contestant, unable to do so. But does get pushed up, does get killed by the baller. Amazing strategy? Luck? Whatever it was, it was, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Thorsty. Thorsty? Thor Thorstyer, excuse me. Is gonna be coming in from the side here. Gonna be trying to do some stuff here. <laughs> Minty Fresh versus Booyah. Booyah! That's so good, Bian. That's so good. Nug Boy gonna be coming in here. Almost getting another wipe on Green Man. This is not looking good. This is not looking good at all for Green Man. They're trying to go green, but uh, Blue is saying we're a little bit too uh, sad to let that happen. Kai gonna be coming here. Gonna be trying to get a kill. However, they are gonna be taken out by the Onslaught. That is Blue. But what an interesting trade for a second there. What a very interesting trade. But right now, Blue just securing their lead even more. Captain Cuttlefresh going to be assisting in Blue's uh, pursuit of uh, winning the game. Space Blue sending out some uh, victory rockets. But right now, Booyah trying to take back control of the point, but going to be crushed by the Dog Boy. Saying I'll have a 16 piece uh, with this meal. A 16 piece Nug. Here's one piece. Here's another piece. And, uh,. Here's the rest of the pieces that they make their way towards the final area. Booyah trying to get any kills that they can. That splat bomb might do it, but no. They are going to lose. And I believe that is going to be the game. As a KO comes out swiftly and justly. That was three, right? That was three? Hey there, Parker. Was that three? Am I insane? Do Nug Boy with the 10. Kitty with the 9. Spacey Lou with the 9. Looking dominant. But yeah, was that was that two or three? Two? People saying two? Is that a couple twos? Eh? Turf turf war, please spare me. You know what? You know what? I'll do that. Turf war. Turf war is a fun thing. 
Let's do it. Ready up. However, we're gonna have Nug Boy on spectator because they were the third last to join. All right, boys, going into it. We have our team set. We have our teams dictated. Phil, but when is the next Odyssey? Uh, probably tomorrow, maybe. If not that, the next day. We'll see. Dude, I wanna see some more kitty dogs. I wanna see some more kitty dogs. Kitty dogs slash Alfreds. I mean, I, I personally think of them as kitty dogs. Uh, mine is just happens to be named Alfred. That's how it works. That's how it works for me. Turf War, more like I don't have a good pun. Hey, got him! All right, let's go, boys. Let's see what we got. So on one team, Cuddlefresh, Kitty, Kai, Booyah versus Sethzilla, Upside Down A, Spacey Lou Star, Thor Steyer, and Wolf Ernie. Wolf, Wolf Ernie? Wolf Ernie! <laughs> like the Muppet? Wolf Ernie? Probably not. It's not spelled the same way, but we're going to be going to it, man. What teams do we got? Alfred is God, next level kitty dog. Thank you, Venus. Thank you. All right, so what teams we got? What colors we got? We got. Is that like a pink purple ish kind of a thing? We'll see in a second. Uh, we got uh, Undefined versus Green. Post in chat where your allegiance goes to. Um, but we're going to be getting right into the game here. So let's look at, at each other's gear. Yo, we got some blasters coming out. Finally, we got the range blasts are going to be coming out. The range blaster is a deadly tool, man. It's a deadly tool. It's gonna be super useful for just taking people out. And unfortunately though, not gonna be able to live for more than five seconds, but also not gonna be able to um, really shine here as um, as they are mainly useful on point-based maps and not so useful on turf war. However, Kai is going to die. Uh, but Kai did talk themselves up as a turf war player. So uh, we will have to see how useful that is in the long run. And right now, it does look like Green does have the majority of this map. However, everything can change in a second, as is the Turf War way. And I want to see what's up with Thorsty. Because, dude, I'm a big fan of the mini splatting. I can't play it! But I, 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 I'm I, a big fan of its style, of its play style. Again, I can't play it for, uh, for uh, Splatdown. But uh, I just think it's a pretty cool weapon. I like, see it done and no! Oh my gosh, Cuddlefresh, not even looking where they're going with those lights in their eyes, just gonna be crushing my, 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 the weapon I was talking up there, man. Oof, oof. Very strong play though from them, very strong play though from them. Gonna be taken out by uh, Sethzilla right there. Dude, I love that name, Sethzilla, with the upside down A, it's, it's, it's very nice. But they are gonna be peppered by the enemy team, peppered by a kitty. Kitty does not have a kitty dog. I'm a little bit disappointed, but that's okay. Kitty gonna be coming in, trying to net any more kills if they can. That's the thing in early turf war. Early turf war is just a matter of how many kills you can get to pepper your kill account. Um, followed by the actual important parts in the last 30 seconds of the game. And right now, Captain Cuddlefresh gonna be trying to get in a little bit of coverage on the right here, but going to be contested by, I believe, Sethzilla back here, rocking that Splooshomatic. Gonna be using. That curly bomb and splash down to so their effective use. Oh, however, I say that, they're gonna be unable to get that kill with it. Whoa! Captain Cuddlefresh with an amazing turnaround splat! As we enter into the last 45 seconds of the game, any picks you can get are going to be useful. Kitty trying to get a little bit of a play here. And right now, I'm gonna look at the map, frankly, as the map tells all. The map tells all, frankly. As we see. A little bit of a kerfuffle happening around the middle. Pink has rallied their forces and is pushing their way into Green's uh, Green's balcony here, Green's platform. However, Green does get to get get a couple picks on them. Thorsty coming in from the top here, going to be trying to get what they can too. Looks like Thorsty and Sethzilla are going to be trying to make a little bit of claim to the map here. Pink is rushing back to the map, trying to overcame, reclaim as much middle as they can. It looks like we have a pretty much a 50-50 split. This might go to green, this might go to purple, to pink. I, I honestly don't know who this is going to go to. I really don't know who this is going to go to. Who we got? Ooh! The 6% lead from undefined pink, purple, red thing is going to be what takes the game. Kai with the most coverage. Kitty with the most kills. Very good play from our teams in ink. So, guys... 
Thank you all for watching. The Splatoon 2 fail fleet battles. Thank you all for watching. Pink resistance up. Post in chat how many wins you got throughout this live stream. Um, and uh, don't, don't go anywhere. Tune in in like a couple minutes. We're going to be playing some Pokemon Black 2 Nuzlocke in a second here. Oh, dude, that, that, this was like a very solid game. That, that was a very solid set of games. This was fun so far. One for one. There you go. Hey, VN, yo, yo, man, let's go. Let's go. But um, we got a seven. We got a two for two. You know, good plays from people. Good plays from people. Ah, all right. So uh, we got some Pokemon coming up in a second. Don't go anywhere unless you don't like Pokemon, in which case I understand. Uh, what do we got coming up tomorrow? We got uh, we got Octodad. We got I want to do some more Odyssey. Some more Pokemon because we gotta finish this. Po we gotta finish Black Two before um, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon come out. Um, 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 um. Oh, we got the new Kirby game. I want to make a video on. We got a lot to do in a in a couple days, but it's it's gonna be pretty fun. All right, boys. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna head right over to Pokemon Black Two Nuzlocke. Don't go anywhere. I'll see you guys in like eh, five minutes. Don't believe the YouTube counter. Don't believe the YouTube counter. I'll see you guys in about five minutes. Thank you all for watching this Splatoon 2 segment. I'll see you guys in a little bit. See you around. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I don't know why I've started to do this at the end. It's just very content to do. All right, let's go, boys.